my gosh, world! I'm alive! That means your assassins failed. They failed so hard. So, basically, yeah, I've been working a lot, been busy with other stuff, and just been procrastinating like crazy, playing a lot of Skyrim. And I figured today's my day off, so I would record something for everybody, especially since I've actually been getting comments, asking for videos, and stuff like that. So I figured, eh, why not? So instead of doing a spider myths, I decided to do a spider facts, because, well, one's pretty much the opposite of the other, so it shouldn't be too hard, right? So a lot of people have actually been wanting to know about wolf spiders. Now, I know that in the Italian regions, um, wolf spider is known as a tarantula, but just for sake of clarification, I'm talking about wolf spiders, as in the little field spiders that carry around their young, not tarantulas. Now, wolf spiders get blamed for a lot of stuff that they're not. Hi, kitty. Um, wolf spiders are not huge, furry spiders. They're not poisonous, they're not venomous, they're not anything like that, and they're not this horrible thing that people seem to have the mental image that they are. Now, a wolf spider, A, the best way to identify it actually isn't by markings, isn't by size, or anything like that. It's actually the arrangement of their eyes. They have a very distinct arrangement of their eight eyes. They are an eight-eyed spider, not a six-eyed. And that's really, honestly, the best way to identify them, kind of like a jumping spider. Their eyes is arranged in a very specific way, and it helps them with their form of hunting and just helps them in their mode of survival in general. Now, a wolf spider isn't very large. Their entire bodies, not their legs, their entire bodies are actually only about a centimeter in, in average. Um, it's about a centimeter in length. They're not very large spiders. And people like to say that um, their house is filled with wolf spiders, but the thing is, wolf spiders don't like to live in houses at all. It's actually very bad for them to live in a house because they are the type of spider that actually goes out and hunts for their prey. And in a house that wouldn't be all that great. They live in fields and just outdoors in general mostly. Um, one thing that I think the one that is being confused as a house spider rather, I mean as a wolf spider rather than what it really is, is there's something called the giant house spider. And the giant house spider, I think, is what everybody thinks a wolf spider is. And another thing is that a wolf spider is actually quite the good mother. It carries its young with her. She will have the egg sac with her almost all the time, no matter where she goes, because like I said, they go out and hunt for their food. They do not catch it in a web, necessarily. And they'll carry the egg sac with them, and then even when the babies hatch, and our tiny, tiny little helpless squishy things, she will have them crawl around on her back, on her episthosoma, or her abdomen, if you want to call it that. And if you ask me, there's a lot of mothers of human species that could take some lessons from that. <coughs> Teen mom. Anyway, like I said in one of my spider myths video, there is a spider that some people like to think clones itself. Now, as I said in that video, it's not a spider that can clone itself internally, because that'd be pretty cool, but no, it can't do that, is the wolf spider with her young on her back. And when the mother is killed, any that were not also killed in the process, run away. Because that's what they do, survival-wise, they have to run away. So stop squishing anything that you can't identify or you are scared of. Because, like I said, wolf spiders are not venomous. They're not dangerous, they're not aggressive, they're not anything that everyone wants to think they are. They're spiders, okay? They just go out and try to find food and help control the insect population. Updating more regularly, and I thought I'd start out this more regular updating with a good video about, you know, wolf spiders. Because I like wolf spiders, I think they're pretty cool. Um, I'll probably be updating on Wednesdays, or I don't know, any other day that I feel up to it. Wednesdays are my day off. Um, also, we are, my husband and I are busy taking care of a sick kitty, Rosa, my tortie, decided that she wanted to almost die. We had to take her to the ER. 
um, the animal, ER, and she actually turns out she has asthma, kitty asthma, which I guess is a thing. And they said her quality of life was going to be just fine and everything like that, but she does need treatment and she even gets a little kitty albuterol and everything like that, so it's just kind of in the process of getting her back to normal and she is feeling much, much, much better. Um, she's actually taking prednisone right now, which anyone who knows what prednisone is, I feel sorry for her too. But yeah, so life is busy, life is crazy, but it's great. And I can't wait to hearing from more of you bros later. And like or favorite if you enjoyed this. If you didn't, then why did you keep watching it? Uh, I will catch you guys next time. You can follow me on Twitter, and you can like or dislike if you're a hater. But we all know what haters going to do. They're going to hate. So... I'll catch you guys next time on whatever I make, and I will catch you then.